Hi guys, uh, I have here a box of LED lights. I'm gonna use this for my scooter, my e electric scooter. So I bought this for just about near five dollars uh, in my local uh, online seller. So this one, it's called the CN Sunny Lights, Auto LED Lights. Uh, this uh, this one is has uh, they they said it will work on nine volts to eighty five volts. So it's gonna be use good for use for e bikes above twelve volts, like twenty four volts. 36 volts and 48 volts so I gonna open this and test this with mo three different voltage so I have here uh, 42 volts adapter uh, this is gonna be my chargers for my e-bike a e-scooter so this one is 12 volts yeah and this one is 19 volts for a laptop so I have here a tester so we can see what the voltage is, is this so we're gonna use first the this 42 volts and see yeah 42 volts and this one is the 12 volts so yeah 12.2 volts so and this one is a 19 volts let's see and there you go 19 volts so we are gonna open this one and test if this one is working with different type of voltage <clears throat> I have here a scissor. There we go. And there it is. Okay. See, it say nine volts to eighty-five volts with uh eighty watts of power. So it has uh, six LED. And there's the other one. So nothing inside the box. So we're gonna put it aside. Oh wait, inside. And see, we are gonna test this one. Okay. Oh, I just use to clean the terminal and so we're gonna use the 12 volt first so we're gonna put the positive inside test it mm, it's working fine so this one is working on 12 volts so we're gonna use the other one so bright so first on the 12 volts and see and there you go super bright <laughs> causing the and there we go okay next we're gonna use the 19 volts I hope it's gonna not burk <laughs> but anyway I can buy another set of this thing and a broken so you're gonna test again 19 volts so this one is a 19 volts so I maybe just a little bit and then And it's work working in the 19 volts see 
so it's work the other one okay let's see things are gonna work and also it's working on 19 volts so for the last we're gonna test this on 42 volts I hope it will not broke <laughs> so they said they claim gonna work on upper voltage so now I use this in my 42 volt charger there you go and put it inside and check if this was gonna work oh yeah it's gonna work oops and the other one oh my god my eyes my eyes <laughs> it's too damn bright so another one and there you go it's work so this one working with different type of voltage so they said they they said this one is a IP what IP65 but I think this not so we're gonna open this one so I'm gonna put this aside so I can open a uh, one of these things looks inside sorry for the camera because let's see they put a Y hope, hope you can see this thing yeah there you go there's a coat inside the only heat sink of this thing is just only this metal yeah the heat sink is just only metal oops ah it has an soldering paste so that's a good one hmm. this is the circuit board i hope you can see in the camera see so this is gonna be a good lights for motorcycles and other application that can range on 9 volts to to 85 volts so this one's gonna work on my scooter so I don't have need to uh, buy an, a voltage uh, what do you call it a step down voltage converter to take 12 volts so let's see uh, they said they claim it on um, with a uh, yes. 65 IP rating but I think the only one that cover with to help to protect is just only this one this chip I don't know what kind of chip it's gonna be an IP six if they cover all the system with any kind of protective coating so but now this one is uh, not good maybe I will put uh, a protective coating for this thing so it will never uh, wet if sometime I cause this one is used in the rain so I'm gonna put this back in where this thing here you go and where is the top So and there's no uh, any rubber lining on the side, so it's not water resistant. 
and you guys uh thank you for watching uh uh you can find the link where you can buy this uh this uh, led lights this one's cheaper one but it's just a variable and it works in any kind of voltage so this is gonna be a nice for e-bikes and other high voltage application so guys uh thank you for watching see you on another video thank you